Hi everyone and welcome to Nico's Valentine's Day special. Today we're making a last minute drop of the hat, oh my god I've forgotten it's Valentine's Day recipe that you all can do. Today we're making homemade chocolate bears. Alrighty guys, a really quick throw together Valentine's Day last minute meal for those fellas and gals who may have forgotten their loved one at this Valentine's Day you can make up to them with these because uh, this is the perfect last minute oh geez I forgot Valentine's Day gift right this is very very simple guys only one ingredient one ingredient and that is chocolate what could be more sexier on Valentine's Day than chocolate? Now we're using two types of chocolate. We've got the milk chocolate and the white chocolate as well. Now, you do have to go out and buy something. Not necessarily this, but something like it. These are molds, okay? These are silicon molds. And as you can see there, they've got the face of a teddy, okay? So we're going to melt the white chocolate and the milk chocolate and we're going to pour them into the molds swirl it around so you've got this beautiful white and milk chocolate uh, look happening and then we will serve them so it can't be easier than that guys can it and uh, I'm sure your loved one will appreciate the thought and the effort so let's get started now guys one of the advantages of living in Australia is it's so hot here in summer and I've just left this out and have a look at that it's really already melted so I've just left it out at room temperature now I am going to melt it just a little bit further okay but um, as you can see there it's pretty much melted you gotta love the Australian summer but of course many would say that it's just my warm heart radiating onto the chocolate and that's why it's melting Alright guys, so uh, like I said, mine probably doesn't need that much melting, but you've heard me say before about the microwave, 10 to 15 seconds, take it out, put it back in, take it out, put it back in, it's actually starting to sound like Valentine's Day night, take it out, put it back in, take it out, put it back, however, that goes into the microwave, um, and uh, 10 to 15 seconds, and just keep watching it so it doesn't burn, until we just want it melted and there we go guys didn't take me long at all right what I want to do is just grab one half here of the milk chocolate and just into the mold don't worry about the spillage okay and then I want another half of the white And then guys, using just a skewer, what I want you to do is just pick at it like that. Just move it around just a little bit so we get that nice sort of milk chocolate going through the white chocolate sort of thing. And when they bite into it, some of it will be white, some of it will be brown. And that combination of white and milk chocolate is gorgeous. Nothing beats it. Alright guys, there you have it. So don't worry too much about what it looks like on the top if you've got some spillage there because what will happen is when you put them out, you won't even see that anyway. So don't worry about it too much. Now that goes back into the fridge to set. Leave it in there for a couple of hours and uh, these will be done. Alrighty guys, we've pulled out our Valentine's Day chocolate teddy bears and I'm just going to show you... just pop them out of the moulds and have a look at that little fella. Hey? Now he's got some white chocolate in there. I'll show you another one that's a bit more swirly. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Your loved one will love you for it. So give this a go guys. It's dead easy for the last minute Valentine's Day recipe. You can put it together with some ribbons and a nice card. What could be more? Anyway guys, uh, 
You don't really need all the ingredients because there's only two, but just in case, they're that way on the side of the page. Check it out. You take care. Have a great Valentine's Day, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>